Drop a like and subscribe in the next five seconds, and when you guys walk outside today, you'll find $100 on the ground. Yo, what is good everybody on YouTube? It is your boy Shaded Rich officially coming back at you guys live with a brand new GTA 5 online video. I know it's been a few days since I uploaded and I do apologize guys. I was out all weekend, but I am officially back with the daily uploads. So you guys can expect a ton of new GTA 5 online money glitches coming out this week. But with that being said, man, since I didn't upload for the past two days, I went ahead and bought a modded account to give away to you guys. So if you guys need a modded account with over five billion dollars on it all you guys got to do is comment how much money you currently have in gta 5 online right now and also make sure you guys follow the steps in the comment section below to go ahead and enter yourself in that giveaway with that being said let's hear a word from the sponsor then get right into it Yo, if you guys are struggling for cash in GTA 5 Online, you need to check out DarwinMods.com. Darwin Mods offers PC recovery services, PC account boosts, PS4 account boosts, and PC modded accounts. Darwin Mods is 100% legit. He has fast delivery, 24-7 live customer support, secure payments, and he also has very cheap packages. If you guys want to go ahead and check out his PS4 account boosts, they're super duper cheap. He has anywhere from 15 million all the way up to 700 million for a very, very low price. So if you guys are struggling for cash or level one rank in gta 5 online check out zara mod today he will be linked in the description below so in today's video we got a brand new casino glitch that is actually working right now i literally recorded this today when i woke up it is a brand new solo money glitch that requires you to not have anything when you enter the casino you guys are going to come over here to this slot machine and it's going to have the same one on the other side you guys are going to come over here and this is basically guys where you're going to start off after you start off over here make sure you have 2500 trips in your pocket and then once you guys get over here what you guys want to do is sit here at this slot machine once you guys sit at the slot machine you just want to get back up and then you basically want to go ahead and pull up your phone and request a job from Simeon now I already requested a job from Simeon so I can't do it again but all you guys need to do is go to your phone call him request a job you should get it on the job list once you guys get it on the job list you're gonna go ahead and click into the job and you guys are gonna have the option to go ahead and accept the job and go up into the clouds or decline the job now you're gonna go ahead and line up with this slot machine to get the right on d-pad in the corner then you're gonna go into that job then you're gonna click on the actual simian job once you guys click on the job make sure you guys are holding down the pause menu right now and then as soon as you let go of the pause menu you're going to click to accept the job and as soon as you guys do that you should get this pause menu and it's gonna sound like you guys click the phone as well as soon as you guys leave the pause menu you're gonna spam right on the d-pad to make you sit down at the slot machine you're gonna go up into the job and you're going to exit once you guys exit the job you're gonna get this weird camera angle and you guys are gonna make your way over to the actual chips lady once you guys get over to the cashier services lady what you guys are going to do is you're going to try and trade in one chip now you're going to sit on that are you sure screen because what's going to happen here is the game is so glitched out it's going to teleport you back over to that slot machine so after you guys wait a few moments it should teleport you back and you guys should have carried the menu over to the slot machine now you guys pretty much can see where this is going now that you guys actually have this in what you guys are going to do is you're going to back out of the actual slot machine and then what you guys are going to do is you're going to go into trade in chips and you're going to click on trade into the max so you guys are going to click y or triangle on playstation and it's going to pull up the max 2500 now why 2500 is because we're going to be betting the max and what this is going to do is it's going to allow us to basically bet the max and basically trade in the chips at the same time and when we do that we won't lose any chips we'll basically have a free play at the slot machine and you guys can keep doing this over and over i'm going to be explaining exactly what happens when you win and when you lose so you guys are going to click triangle or y to bet the max and then you're going to click accept to trade in the chips and play the slot machine as you guys can see i lost so if you do lose what you guys are going to have to do is get up off the slot machine well it's going to force you off because you don't have any more chips and you're going to need to go ahead and buy the 2500 chips again once you guys buy the 2500 chips what you guys are going to do is you're going to go over to trade in chips you're going to tap x or a one time and then you're going to get the alert to say are you sure you want to trade in 2500 chips okay now i'm going to explain this to you so it makes sense without you guys even knowing steps just so you guys can understand what you're doing so you don't get confused basically what you guys are going to do is you're going to be having to click x or a on trade in chips and you're going to play the slot at the same time before you play the slot make sure you click y or triangle to bet the max because the max is 2500 all we are trying to do here is simply this we're just trying to bet the max at the same time as we accept 
trading in the chips that way when we trade in the chips and we basically play the slot machine the game never registers that we actually spent the chips so you guys get a free play it's simply that simple all you guys have to do is just get free plays now if you guys go ahead and win i'm gonna go ahead and explain what you have to do but if you do go on a losing streak it's okay guys you're not losing anything because every single time you bet the 2500 it's going back into your bank so it's just the same exact money that you keep on using you're not spending more you're not losing anything so as you guys can see here i won the 5000 now that i won the 5000 it's a little bit different what you guys are going to do is you're going to click down on the right stick on any controller that you play on once you click down on that right stick what it's going to do is it's going to pull up the rules okay now once you guys go ahead and you pull up the rules basically what this is going to do is it's going to glitch out the menu and it's going to allow you to basically put those chips into your bank okay so you don't lose any more and it's going to help you get off of the slot machine because if you click b while you guys are on the menu from the cashier who gives you the chips it's going to make you lose that menu and you're going to have to do the entire glitch over again to glitch out the menu to set at the slot so when you guys get this rules menu you guys are just going to simply tap b once you guys tap B, it's going to put those chips in your bank and then you guys are going to be able to acquire the chips again and then go ahead and do the trade method and then you guys go ahead and sit down and constantly keep playing. I know guys, it does sound a little bit confusing when I first watched the steps and read the steps about this glitch. I was very confused, I'm not going to lie, but it is very, very easy. The only thing that is really time consuming is when you guys are trying to glitch out the pause menu and the job. You literally just hold down that pause menu as soon as you let up. I would say half a second you go ahead and tap a or you tap x and then as soon as you guys do that it should allow you to accept the job and it should allow you to pull up the pause menu now as soon as you guys go from that pause menu you're gonna need to spam right on the d-pad i highly suggest if you guys get the pause menu glitch done then you guys should just spam right on the d-pad to go ahead and go into the actual slot machine so that way you guys will be glitched out and you'll be able to bring the menu over to the slot machine now once you guys have all that complete you will be doing this glitch you guys can do this glitch for as long as you want you'll never lose any chips you'll never lose any money you'll only gain from doing this and this is why this is actually worth doing and worth actually taking the time out to do this rockstar will figure out a way to patch this so i highly suggest you guys try this today maybe you guys are in school when you guys get out of school it'll still be working maybe you guys are at work when you guys get off of work this should still be working like i said guys you can make a ton of money from this although you don't win every time there's never going to be a glitch where you can win the slot machine every time this is the closest thing to it i mean you're not really losing so i guess you're always going to be winning if you look at it from that point of view but if you guys do decide you guys are going to go ahead and do this you guys have a higher win chance or a percentage of winning the jackpot because you're not losing anything you get what i'm saying so you guys can do this for maybe 30 minutes to an hour say you got a little time on your hand you're just going to be getting up once you guys get the hang of doing this glitch you literally will be doing it every two seconds it's not going to take you that long to add the chips and just basically trade it in it's pretty simple guys and pretty straightforward if you guys want to end the glitch and you want to exit all you have to do is just back out of the menu and you won't be glitched out anymore and you guys can just go ahead and do whatever you want to do me i just got up and i went ahead to spin the wheel i didn't win nothing too spectacular you guys know how this freaking game is it's so rigged but we will always figure out ways to make a ton of money in gta 5 online from the casinos to any duplication glitch or money glitch that does come out so if you guys are excited for that go ahead and smash a like on today's video make sure you guys go ahead and comment team shaded if you made it this far and you are a loyal supporter of the team shaded community and also man if you guys are brand new go ahead and subscribe so you guys can join the team shaded community and you guys can see daily gta 5 online money glitches here on the channel and be rich in gta 5 online with that being said it's me boy shaded rich i'm signing out